put my hand on the counter to steady myself, and that's when it felt like something was happening in my head, that, like a transformer explodes. It felt like something exploded in my head. May 3rd, 2019, Maurice Hilliard was going back to bed after using the bathroom, but then... I felt sparks coming all through my head, and I was totally out of control. I screamed, and I fell to the floor. I woke up and I looked toward the bathroom. There was my husband, Maurice, on the floor. And I noticed he couldn't speak, he couldn't move. Immediately, I started to pray, and I prayed the word of God for healing. Losing his ability to speak, Maurice knew he was in trouble. I said, C -c 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 call 911. Paramedics rushed Maurice and Arlene to nearby Chesapeake General Hospital in Virginia. Maurice was disoriented, had slurred speech, and chest pains. The main concern that the doctors had when they first brought me in, they thought I was, ha I'd had a stroke. I prayed that he'd be completely here from the top of his head to the soles of his feet, and that he would have no side effects or anything like that. I was beginning just to say, God, you got to help me. Maurice was wheeled back immediately for a CT scan. Then, as the technician was injecting an imaging dye into his brain, Maurice felt something change. I began as that dye went in to feel like, hey, I'm coming back again. <laughs> that dye is washing. And I felt myself getting whole again. Of course, he knew it wasn't the dye at work. I just said, Lord, you've done this. Whatever happened to my body, I'm healed. The preliminary CT scan was inconclusive, so doctors kept Maurice at the hospital for observation and ordered an MRI for that afternoon. Meanwhile, Maurice's speech and mind continued to clear as he began telling everyone about his miracle. You know, the nurses and people who came in to clean the room, I, all I could just say, what a good God that I served and how, how he'd healed me so. The next day, the MRI results confirmed Maurice had had a stroke. It was on the left side of his brain, so that will affect the right side of your body, typically. When he came for his MRI, he really didn't have any deficits. They had all subsided. When I got the results, I just rejoiced so much. I was so thankful that God had healed me. I even told the doctor, you know, God has healed me. Then someone else found healing, but not in the physical sense. As Maurice talked about God's goodness, Ashley began to share her pain, the pain of a troubled heart. She began to say, I'm angry with God. I lost my father. God took my father. I was really unhappy with my relationship with God because I didn't understand why my dad got taken from me. I almost was so angry, like I could feel it every day, like I was carrying it with me. And I say, oh, Ashley, your father is still alive. He's still in you. I just told her how much love God had for her. After months of anger and resentment. Like it just all washed away. This man is here. This is your angel. He's been sent to you to let you know that God is all around and everything has happened the way it's supposed to happen. It was amazing. She says, I'm not, I'm not angry anymore. She said, God must have sent you here for me. God must have sent you here for me. That afternoon, after several more tests, Maurice was discharged with a clean bill of health. And the doctor says, you're good to go. I walked out of the hospital that I had gone in 35 hours earlier. Today, Maurice is symptom-free and healthier than ever. He thinks back to his time in the hospital as he continues to try and be an encouragement to others. He's still here. He's still able to walk. He's still able to talk. And that's what's so great about God, that you can give your testimony and encourage others. I know that God is with me every day, and you just never know when something's gonna happen to you to change your life. By me, talking to Mr. Hilliard for a half hour maybe. You know, I helped him, but he changed my life forever. If Ashley could say, God sent you by here for me, and I had a miracle, and if it took that, God, for you to get the glory, 
God, it was worth it all. It was worth it all. 